Hello everybody, welcome back to Dragon Quest XI. I am your host, Cheeky Walnut, and today we're going to make some progress forward. So, the last episode we got the Red Orb, I did a little bit of grinding off screen, and now we're going to head this direction towards the Door of Departure. I'm going to cut some grass real quick first, because I want as many items as I can get. I'll cut some grass and me tackle the tree. Sparkly sap and some buzzberries. Okay. Pass the heel slime. Or, yeah, it's a heel slime, but here's slime. Here's slimes are pink. I remember that. I actually think I remember that for like Dragon Warrior Monster. Way back in the day. We go under this tree. Or I guess root to a tree. And there's a couple of things up ahead to gather. Let's see what we got. Did you really think you would escape me, Dark Spawn? Damn it, they found us. Well, don't just stand there. Come on. Those are some convenient horses. Sorry, I just broke my rule. You shall not escape me, Dark Spawn. Run now. You have won. The game has not even begun. Spoilers, Hendrick, buddy. Not more. <sighs> Whew. We made it. That was too close. So, uh... Where exactly are we? I don't recognize this place at all. You shall not escape me! Awarded for evading capture by the dauntless Sir Hendrik, who stunts you still, believing you to be a harbinger of calamity. Okay. That was not what I meant to do. I meant to check out a couple of things. Cool. Click the map, check sparkly spots, none nearby. Wait, hold up, hold up. Mount Huji, that's what I thought it said. Did 
do some saving real quick. Nothing has disturbed this place in aeons, and yet here you are. I can only imagine what curious path has led you here, but mine is not to reason why. Perhaps I can be of assistance. What brings you to our church in the dead of night, child? Confession. Confess to me all that you have done, child, that I might record it in an adventure log. Checking adventure logs, please wait. By the way, anyone looking? Yes, it says playtime 40 hours, roughly. That's not how long it takes to get here. That is, um because I left the game on for a long period of time while I was not at my computer because I apparently hate electronics, so. I haven't seen you around here before. Well, whatever you're doing, you're gonna need supplies, and that's where I come in. Welcome to my roving emporium, how can I help you? Copper sword, bot sword, yeah, nothing I really want. You're good. Enemies. What is this? River she slimes. Ow, that didn't hurt. Nope. Wait. I got an ability for this. That works. <laughs> she slimes are defeated. Uh, enemy was too weak for experience. Treasure chest drop. Medicinal herb. I have to do a cursory glance around and make sure I don't miss any chests. What are you? Draw drones. Too stunned to move. than the Kravids I just fought. Who else yep, wants some? That's <laughs> kind of what I thought. Bird? How about you, Garuda? I knew you were Garuda. I knew it! Boink. Okay, two hits. Huh. Oh, they get Easy. experience. Okay, cool. So I've got some enemies that I can get experience from. If they aggro me, I'm gonna kill them. Otherwise, I'm gonna run past most of these for right now. Sizz? Oh, How dare you. Oh, I didn't kill him. Well, I get two attacks in a row. That's fine. Uh, yes, agility. Another one bites the dust. 35 experience points. Don't give me experience. You are worth nothing to me. Okay. Nothing nearby. See a sparkling over there. Do 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 do. What the fuck is that noise? What are you? An enemy, obviously. Fight. Group of enemies. Okay. That hurts. It's got a drum, I bet it buffs. I'm gonna kill it first, if I can. Yeah, also it's about as hard as the Garuda. It's fine. Mongo Drongo, by the way. Cool. Oh, actually, not a bad amount of experience either. Warmaline. Wait. 
don't think it aggroed me, but I don't think it was that. Only one enemy. Cool. Fine. Beat the crap out of it. Attack. 20. Ow. Attack. 19. Attack. 19. Mongo Drongo is defeated. 33 experience, 18 gold. The birdie. There's the birdie. Pop off. Run past these slimes. This boy. There's a chest over there. How the heck do I get to that? Can't swim. We've already been over this. Can't jump down there. There's probably a way to like lower the water level somewhere somehow. Group of bonger drongers. Oof! They got the first move. Now. Oh, that. Me. There's a group of them. Says. Wait. I should have used the other thing that I just had. I'm silly. Should have used the helicopter. Whatever. It's fine. Ha! Huh. Easy. Some strong medicine. Oh, cool. That's better than what I've been using. It's also bubbling hot, so I don't think I'd want to be in that water. Fight you. I said I was going to run past everything. I may have lied. Helicopter. Another one bites the dust. Oh, that actually just reminded me that thing right there. So recently, the, the Queen like biopic just came out, and uh, you know, Bohemian Rhapsody. And so there's a, a theater near me that um, actually is showing it, but they're like marquee, like the sign they put out front doesn't quite fit the entirety of Rhapsody. Um, and the R that they have for Rhapsody looks kind of like a P. So. Uh, my cousin and I were going around, and we just looked at it, and to be totally honest, the the sign just said Bohemian Fap, and that is my story of the week. That's it, everybody. Yep. Anyway, so, continuing on into this town, after that stupid little story of mine. I bet there's going to be a cutscene when I walk in, because I know this is a town, obviously. There's a sign out in front of everything. Civilization at last. And I think it's safe to say we're not being followed anymore. For now, at least. <laughs> oh, so anyway. <laughs> Two travelers come. Their timing is auspicious as the day's new dawn. Oh no. My bathhouse awaits. Savor its steamy embrace as frogs do spring rain. Rejoice, honored guests, for to mark this happy day, you may sweat for free. Um, we're kind of busy to be sweating. Thanks. Appreciate the offer, though. Too busy to bathe? Too busy to wash away the scent of the road? Huh? <laughs> okay. Maybe I'm not at my freshest. Fine. I'll visit your bathhouse if it means that much to you. 
Might as well go sweat off the journey while we have the chance. I'll see you in there, okay? The winds bring a guest. Joyfully, I shall guide him to where bliss awaits. <laughs> So now that we are in the town of, I gotta talk to one of this guy right here to make sure. Beneath Mount Fuji, like snowstorms on summer days, visitors are rare. Your blue-haired comrade steams in the stair-top sauna. They peek in the mist. Great. Yeah, they all speak in haiku. So we're gonna end that here for right now. Uh, thank you for joining me. I have been Cheeky Walnut, and I will continue to be Cheeky Walnut. Remember to like the video if you want to, uh, subscribe if you'd like, leave a comment, follow me on Twitter, comment at me at Twitter, email me if you want. I don't know if you want to talk, just say something, really. Anyway, bye bye